everyone. Um, this is my I'm Alive video, number two, day two. Um, I took an all-night train from Budapest to Krakow, Poland last night. Um, didn't get as much sleep as I should have. I'm really tired, so I'm gonna keep my sunglasses on because I'm sure the bags under my eyes could probably um, carry all my luggage for this trip. So today I have spent most of the morning slash, it's like one o'clock here, so about a little bit of the afternoon, in Auschwitz. And I'm gonna try not to cry because it's a really, really sad, tired experience, very humbling, um, and it's very upsetting. Probably the thing that got me the most was the hair. <laughs> and I texted my mom about this too. They had um, 2,000 kilograms, about a, about a, t a ton of hair hair actual actual like women's hair where when they killed the Jewish women they cut off their hair to use their hair in cloths and socks and carpets in Germany and they had it was actual it was their hair they said it was probably from about 40,000 Jewish women's worth of hair to make one ton that got me. That got me really well. <laughs> I didn't. I took everything I had not to cry when I was in that room. Um, I actually went into a gas chamber. And um, yeah, that's about all I got. I'm sorry. I'm not very excited and happy about this one. Um, uh, there's actually three different parts of um, Auschwitz. There's the main Auschwitz, then there's Auschwitz Birkenau, and then there's another one. It starts with an M, and I can't remember that one. It, um, but it doesn't exist anymore. It's completely gone. The one that I just toured was just regular Auschwitz, and we're about ready to go to Auschwitz Birkenau next and see it. And then I will be going back to Krakow. So, and then I'll be taking another all-night bus. It's a bus this time, not a train, to Berlin tomorrow. So yeah, that's all I got for today. Uh, sorry, this is not more exciting. Maybe tomorrow will be a little bit better. Um, but yeah, it's all good. Love y'all. Bye.